Hotfix 24.2.8 is live on PC and we have some changes to Titania. The first of which is that her Razor Flies will now gain health when Titania kills enemies in Razor Wing, and they have also increased Titania's Thorns and Entangle Tribute ranges to 30 meters. For Mesa, they did bring back her round and curved arse, so you have that back in there for those that enjoy Mesa Prime. They also added missing offsets for the Mesa Presido skin on some of the armor sets. They made improvements towards Mesa Prime's attachments when using Tenogen skins, and they also fixed Mesa's Peacemaker weapon damage, not showing correctly within the Simulacrum. For Baruch, his Elude Conal Indicator will now only appear for the player who is playing as him, they made slight tweaks to Barut's Elude ability effect, and they also fixed the issue where using Transference while using Baruch's Savagery would break his custom UI. Now, mining changes, they did reduce the flashlight effect, and they also made improvements towards the Valus Mining Deposit spawn locations. Now, for the Stalker, there was one change and two fixes. The one change was that his smokescreen ability now has a 20 second cooldown, and as for the fixes, they are up on your screen. They also made fixes towards the Strain mod set, that is of course the mod set for the Helminth Charger, and they also made some fixes towards the Magus Revert Arcane. Now for changes that came in Hotfix 24.2.8, they have reverted the previous Helio scan change, where it would no longer scan Fortuna Lore Fragments, he now scans everything. They also updated Nyx and Nyx Prime's passive descriptions to more accurately entail her recent tweaked passive, the Syndicate Offering screen will now display former and mastered icons. They reduced the Nova Null Star ability firing sound. They made it so any red Twitch drop inbox message will be removed from your inbox after 30 days of opening it. They increased the brightness of the Argonax enemy highlight effect. And they made performance improvements related to firing the Imperator and improvements toward enlarged fonts appearing unpleasant. As for the fixes that came in Hotfix 24.2.8, they are available on your screen, or you can check it out by going to the link in the description and reading it straight from the forum post. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time.